everyone, today I'm going to be showing you the features that I think should be added to Greenville. So the first one is backup cameras. So if I go in reverse, you'll see that the backup camera appears on my screen and you can see an outline that shows me where I need to move my car, how far back I can move my car. So it just helps you with going in reverse and backing up. The next feature is trailers. So in the first picture, you'll see a truck and in the back, there's a trailer. So that way you can carry like hay or any other supplies that you might need as a farmer or whatever your job is going to be. And you can see that the trailer has working blinkers and brake lights. So that's what I think should be features of a trailer, like having working lights, Another thing that I think should be added to Greenville is RVs. So in this picture, there's basically an RV or camper and you can go inside it and it would be a little house inside there. So basically you can just camp in it and go to the campsites. I think this would be a good feature for Greenville because you can do camping role plays and it's also just like a cool feature that should be added. Next is adding a tow hitch to your car. I can select the tow hitch here and I can actually put it on my car and this will let me tow the trailer that I was talking about earlier. It would be cool to have trailers in Greenville because it's a realistic game and Greenville doesn't have this yet. Also, car model badges would be cool. For example, the Nissan Rogue. So you can see that the model badge on the Nissan Rogue will have it where you'd normally see a model badge on the car. And also, it would be the model name for the car in Greenville and not in real life. Another feature that I think should be added is slower steering options. So they already have slow, medium, and fast steering options in Greenville but sometimes they're just a little bit too fast depending on what car you get. So I think they should have an even slower setting or even like a setting where you can set the exact steering speed that you want. So I think this would make the game more realistic and you won't be turning and your car moves like so far to the right or left. Also adaptive cruise control. This feature would be good to have in Greenville because your car will match the speed from the car in front of you when you are going faster and then when you're slowing down. So I think that that would be cool because you kind of don't have to like touch the keyboard or whatever you're using to control your car to slow down or speed up and it also helps like prevent crashes. So you'll see a little icon pop up on your screen which basically just helps you to know that adaptive cruise control is on. Different braking speeds and also making it so that the brake lights stay on longer when you're braking would be cool feature to have in Greenville because it's more realistic and when you hit the brakes it's just you're not going to stop right away and the brake lights aren't going to go on for a second and then turn off. Sometimes when you're slowing down and you're going fast, going to a lower speed and you hit the brakes, the brakes aren't going to go on for just one second. They're going to stay on for a while. So I think having the brake lights stay on a little bit longer would also make it more realistic. Next is bumpier and uneven roads or more realistic roads because the roads in Greenville right now are smooth like they don't have any texture or bumps in the road. Here you can see a car going up the hill so I think it would make the game more realistic. Also putting supplies on the roof rack would be a really cool feature to have because it's also part would be part of like a camping feature and putting supplies on your roof rack would just like look cool so it would be really cool for a camping update different tire options would also be good because depending on if you're driving on a slippery road or it's raining or you need off-road tires for something having those options for the tires would be a good option to have so you can see the tow truck has different tires or rims on them. I think this would just make it more realistic to have the tires textured too. That way it looks more realistic in the game. Also having an option to save the cars in the dealership would be a good feature to have because sometimes you want to save a car but you don't want to buy it or you don't have enough room in 
your inventory to buy the car. So I think that would be a feature that a lot of people would like to have in the game. So if you want any features to be added to Greenville or any ideas, you can leave them in the comments below. And that's it for this video and I'll see you in the next video.